Stand-up comic for how many years? 30 years. Right, you started your own uh, comedy club, of course, up yeah. there in the North East. Yeah, I was 30 years of stand-up, and the one thing I realised about that was that nobody knew who I was, you know? Yeah. I mean, if I'd been a spy, that would have been a brilliant career. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Whereas now, after Ken Loach's film, I, Daniel Blake, what a film. Have you seen that film, folks? That is some film. <laughs> that is some <laughs> film. I, right, Daniel Blake. Brilliant. And now... Overnight stardom. It has, yes. That's... Gone pretty crazy. I know, but they, they always call it that, overnight stardom. It's mad. 30 years on the clubs, yeah. Yeah, amazing. And has it, has it changed your life? Oh, it? yeah. I, I mean, the red carpet in Cannes was... Like I say, the, the BAFTAs was insane. I mean, I'm standing on the... I was introduced to Meryl Streep, and she was saying, I saw your film, I thought it was great. And, you know, me being working class, you know, people said to me, why did Ken pick you? It's because I'm working class, you know? I mean, you can tell I'm working class, I've got little bits of scratch cord under my fingernails. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and when I was at all the showbiz parties, you know, you always try to think, you know, I'm going to be like David Niven. Yeah. But, you know, the working class sort of thing comes out. When I was getting champagne at the BAFTA party, it took me all my, sort of, like, all my, sort of, like, to say, to, to, to not start shouting, Meryl, it's all free! It's all free, Meryl! <laughs>